let's begin our meditation. And so once again, with our backs straight, sitting in our chairs or laying on a flat surface, completely comfortable. We begin with our eyes open, deep breath in through the nose, out through the mouth. Deep breath in through the nose and out through the mouth. Deep breath in through the nose, out through the mouth. Gently closing our eyes. We are aware of our surroundings. And so normal, natural sounds, birds outside the window, even if you're at your office, there may be computer sounds or other voices. Wherever you are, you are in a quiet space, a private space, and yet life still goes on around you. And so when those noises come, you're not afraid or annoyed. It's just life. And we turn our attention to the breath. The normal, natural rhythm that God has fine-tuned your body with. We're also grateful for just a moment away from the hustle and bustle. And so we feel and experience that light, that wonderful, all-encompassing light that is the love of God. That no matter where we are, where we go, or what we go through, nothing, nothing can separate us from that love, which is his light. And so now we enter into the inner court. Again, we have been at the candlesticks. We have been at the table of showbread. We have been at the altar where our prayers continue to go up without words. But just as we remember to pour in the cup of incense. And then as the smoke arises, it goes all the way up to heaven as a sweet smelling savor before our God. We know he hears our prayers. He hears those things we speak and he hears those things we do not speak. We have offered our hearts and we have asked him to read our hearts. And so now it's time to go into the Holy of Holies. Now you understand yourself as not just priest, but high priest. The royal priest is also the high priest. Now, before, you would have to look to your left and enter the Holy of Holies through the opening that was on the left. Now, because of the cross, you can enter straight through. You don't have to come in from the side. You don't have to go out and come in through a different entrance way. You just walk right in. 
to the Holy of Holies. Just walk in. Close the curtain behind you and just take it all in. You are in the Holy of Holies where God is. There is the Ark of the Covenant there is the mercy seat on top where the angels' wings touch each other. There are the poles that carry the ark. But there's something else in the Holy of Holies now. There is the cross. There is the wood that bore our Savior's body that's now in the most holy place. But this is your time to be in the Holy of Holies. You must see yourself as the High Priest. And whereas you have worn your holy robes, now in the Holy of Holies, you cover your head. So imagine yourself covering your head with a cloth, with a scarf, with anything that will keep your head covered in the presence of the Lord. It's just a sign of additional holiness. You will not be banished, but out of reverence, out of understanding your in a deeper place in God. You cover your head. And now you offer thanks to God for having access to the Holy of Holies, the most holy place and you just take it in and offer thanks. You kneel before his presence and you bow head to the floor, not physically but spiritually, and you offer him thanks from that prostate, prostrate position. Rising to your feet, you turn and walk through the curtain.
you offer another cup before the altar. You let God read your heart after being in the most holy place of the tabernacle. You now turn your attention back to the breath. Deep breath in through the nose. Out through the mouth. Deep breath in through the nose, out through the mouth. Deep breath in through the nose, out through the mouth. Gently opening your eyes. Grace and peace.